Hey you guys, it's Denise at My Luxury First, and today I wanted to do a little unboxing, basically. I mean, I actually already took it out of the box, but I wanted to show you guys some gifts that maybe you guys could get, or ladies could get for their men. And I have four items here. The first item that I got, and I'll leave the links below so that way you can check them out. I got this watch. Now... Um, it says that it's a stainless steel back, and I believe the brand might be Techno Pave or Techno Pave. It's supposed to be water resistant, but basically it's a like watch that's kind of like blingy. Um, it's brown, and I feel like it's a cool watch for you know a night that, or it just for any time, but maybe not really any time because it could probably get scratched up. But this is how it looks um, on the inside. And it's kind of like blingy. And I like the details on the sides. And then this is how the back looks. And so if it's on your man, it's going to be kind of big. And some men, they like a big body watch, you know what I mean? So I thought that that watch would be cute for my man just to have like a bunch of different watches to um, be able to choose from. Because you know us girls, we always have a bunch of jewelry that we're choosing from. And men, they usually, well from my experience with my husband, he only grabs from one or two items. And so I'm like, let me get him a bunch of like, you know, fashion jewelry that he could wear as well. So I got him this watch. And then I got him another watch. The second watch is this one and today is father's day so happy father's day to everyone but his birthday is also in a couple days so i don't know how i'm gonna you know split up the gifts but i got him another watch and this watch i felt like was kind of unique it comes inside of this and the brand is o-u-l-m a unique designer it says and this is the watch it's a watch that has like three faces on it so I thought that that would be kind of cool. And um, on the back, it says stainless steel back. But just because it says stainless steel back doesn't mean like it's a stainless steel watch. It's just the back that's stainless steel. And on the side, these are the dials. And um, it says that this is genuine leather, but it was kind of a cheap watch. So I don't I'm not for sure if it's genuine leather. I guess after your man wears it for a while, you'll see if it's genuine leather because if it tears up quickly, then it probably wasn't genuine leather. But it's also a big body watch. So when I say big body, I mean big face. Cause you know how like girl watches, we usually have the little faces and why well, call it faces? But um, the guys, I feel like their watches should be big. So that's his, that second watch. And then I got him a third watch, which I'm not sure if I can open it, but the brand is Smith & Wesson. And Smith & Wesson is really known for guns and stuff. And my husband loves guns and of everything guns. He, um, that's like something that he really likes. This says that it's a military watch and it has three interchangeable military straps. So this um, watch actually, I kind of don't want to open it because I don't want to, mess it up for him opening it let me see if i could open it without tearing it up this watch actually doesn't have a big face i would say it's not a big body it's watch. probably a big body for a girl as you can see on my wrist is small so this one the straps are like softer you know it's not like a, a play leather or any type of leather material and this um it has a black strap, but it also has two extra straps with it. So um, it has like a green one, I see. So that way he can change his straps and make him feel like he has different watches on. And it also has this like beige khaki colored one. So that's basically three in one, a three in one watch. So yeah, it has three straps and um, the inside looks like this. And it says Smith and West Wesson in there. Is it Weston? Smith and Wesson. A couple of his um, guns are by that brand. So that's why when I looked up Smith and Wesson and I saw that they had some watches, I was not, I never, you know, thought of that they would have watches. I always just 
when I think of Smith and Wesson, I think of knife. He has a knife, a knife that is Smith and Wesson also. So Smith and Wesson, they also have other things to choose from. So if your guy is into guns and military stuff, and maybe he has some things that are already Smith and Wesson, well, here's something else to add to his collection. It's this watch. Oops, I didn't put the watch in right. And it has three straps with it, so that means um, he can always change the straps to make it make him feel like he has three watches instead of just the one. So I thought that was really good. So that's three watches that I got him because I just want him to have like a bunch of watches to choose from. And then I also got him this case right here, which is just like a case to put your bullets in. So it. It's for tiny bullets, obviously, but you have all these spaces right here that you can put your bullets in. And basically, it's just something like a ammo box. So, um, again, if your guy is into hunting or something like that, or if he's into shooting, he goes to the shooting range, something like that, then he could, you could get him one of these. And this, it just has like a bunch of little spaces where he can have all his bullets. In case he doesn't have anything to put his bullets in, now he'll have something that he can secure his bullets in when he's, you know, going or whatever. Like going to the shooting range or going out to go hunting, shooting, whatever he does like that. Or even if he has like a concealed weapons permit and um, he wants to carry extra bullets with him, this is a case that he could use for that. And I think they have different colors and I believe um, you can put a hundred rounds in here. So this is a single ammo box. And so for those four items, I will have the links below if you want to check them out. Everything's pretty much cheap, so it's not like you're gonna be spending a lot of money on your man, but it's the thought that it it's like basically giving your man stuff to choose from instead of him just grabbing, you know, because men are pretty simple. So, well, from my experience, my husband, he's pretty simple. So, um, I've, I'm going to give him those things and see if he likes that. So, if any of these little gifts or tips helped you, please give my video a thumbs up and please subscribe for more. Thank you, and I will check you guys out later. Have a great day. Bye.